and we're excited for what we have in store. Coming up next, boys 110 meter hurdles. And we saw some records go down just yesterday. Meet records taken down in the prelims. And more fireworks potentially as we crown a champion this morning. Boys won 10 hurdles in that first round. We saw Josh Mooney and Nathaniel Ryan, Abdul Sai Savan, all run incredibly fast, but Joshua Mooney with a big tailwind and he went and broke the meet record. But then a little bit later on, saw some semifinals and in those semifinals, Nathaniel Ryan into a headwind, broke the meet record. Sai Savan also was under the previous meet record and was in second, so lots to be excited for, Dana. Yeah, I'm absolutely stoked to see this race. This is really when you bring the best of the best together, and these guys have raced each other many, many times, especially at New Balance Nationals indoors, and they're just focused on today cleanly getting over these hurdles. We saw a lot of false starts yesterday, so patience in the blocks, making sure everything's set up correctly, and executing the race. I'm mostly excited to see how Sai Savan responds to this pressure off of being the indoor New Balance National Champion. Coming out, it's always hard to repeat and grab that title a second time. Big final ahead as these athletes take their final run outs from the blocks. And in historic Franklin Field, you can see they're blocked in this bowl we've been talking about all weekend, this brick that's containing them, giving some great protection from any wind that's going on. You can see the flag, the New Balance flag is waving just a touch. So we'll have to see what the wind readings are for this race. But I anticipate the weather looks perfect. It's going to be a fast day. Lots of excitement around this race. Having returners from the 60 meters indoors, Dana, that produced some great results, not only in the heats, but also earlier this indoor season in the 60s. Yeah, Abdul Sai Savan was the indoor 60 meter champion. Joshua Mooney from Browns Bear TC, second in that race. And Yasha Brown is third. So we had the one, two, three returning from indoor. And add, just to add to that, you've got Nathaniel Ryan who's now the meet record holder. Got Braxton Brand of Ann Arbor TC in lane eight from Western Branch, Antonio Smith from Washington Township Elite. He'll go in seven, that's Shia Brown. In lane six from ATL Zoom, the indoor 60 meter champion of New Balance Indoor Nationals, Abdul Sai Savan. In five from Scotch Plains Fanwood Track Club. Meet record holder Nathaniel Rand. In four from Bounds Bears. Set a meet record in the heats yesterday, Joshua Mooney. And from San Antonio Swift going in lane three, Malik White. And going in lane two from the DM Stags, it's Anthony. Waterman. Championship boys, 110 meter hurdles. Time to crown a champion. New Balance Nationals. Mooney in four, 
Rayan, meet record holder in five. Sai Savan, the indoor champ in six. Brown, third place indoor in seven. Eyes on the middle of the track. And they're off and they're gonna bring him back up. They hit the first hurdles. It's hard to see, see a little bit what the officials angle. saw there. Officials at this level of meet, just a little bit more strict than what these athletes are used to at some of their high school meets. As these very well trained officials. And out it was lane three, Malik White, who just flinched a little bit. And a false start to Malik White. Gets a red card. Always so disappointing to see. Very tough. And by the book, that's the right call, but always disappointing to see an athlete miss out an opportunity to race, especially high stakes race like this. Field is down to seven. Waterman, Mooney, Rayan, Saisavan, Brown, Smith, and Bran. set and another one lane eight Antonio Smith full step out of the blocks and green card to the field this time sounds like the officials must have told them to come up Sometimes there's too much noise in the stadium. It's really hard to hear the officials. And you can tell because of all of that noise, they're asking everyone to tone it down. So now we've got Waterman, Mooney, Rayan, Sai Savan, Brown, Smith, and Bran. And we'll do it for a third time. Boys 110 meter hurdles championships. New balance nationals outdoor from Franklin Field. Meet record holder in the top three from indoor in lanes four through seven. And they're off. Sai Savan and Rayan out well. Rayan in five. Mooney in four. Out in lane seven, Yashaya Brown. Here comes Sai Savan. Sai Savan clips last hurdle. Mooney. Mooney's going to take it. 13 48, Joshua Mooney with the clean run. He's going to be your New Balance Nationals champion. Mooney almost looks relieved. Great running, hug from Abdul Sai Savan. Brilliant run from Joshua Mooney. Got over all the hurdles cleanly. And really picked up the speed to execute on those final two hurdles to get just a touch forward of Sai Savan. Joshua Mooney. Cool, calm, and collected as Nathaniel Rayan got out ahead of him to the first hurdle. Rayan with just a jump on the field. Rayan started clipping hurdles with that trail leg, and then it was Sai Savan who looked like he had it there, clipped 
the last two of the last three hurdles, and Mooney just had a little bit cleaner of a run. Desai Savan batters the second last hurdle. Mooney maintains momentum. It's Mooney, the winner, Sai Savan second. Nathaniel Ray in third. Braxton Brand in fourth. Rishaya Brown fifth. Antonio Smith sixth. And in seventh, Anthony Waterman. What a run from Joshua Mooney. Joshua Mooney came here, executed. The senior from Bones Bears to see. Making his mark at Franklin Field. Second place indoors to Abdul Sai Savan. And he comes back into a 